Most dictionaries say a robot is an automated machine that can be programmed to perform a variety of specific mechanical functions. And here in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, at the Carnegie Science Center, there is no shortage of them. In what has been billed as the largest robotics exhibit in the entire world, you can see robots tracking objects and even playing basketball. That's not all you'll find inside this 60,000 square foot science center, though. There are interactive exhibits geared toward younger children, including tornadoes, earthquakes, and even beach balls that float by themselves. The Science Center is really a unique family destination in Pittsburgh, and our mission over the years has really been to delight and to entertain and to inspire, as well as to educate. In a separate building, just steps away from the first, is SportsWorks, a place that features full-body interactive exhibits that teach the science behind sports. From motion simulators to rock climbing walls, you won't run out of things to experience here. And probably one of the most popular exhibits we have is actually one of our very first that goes back uh, almost 90 years now, our Miniature Railroad and Village, which features a, a 5,000 square foot miniature railroad uh, exhibition with over 100 uh, animated miniatures that represent Western Pennsylvania uh, at the turn of the, of the 18th century. During the summer months, you can also head around the back of the building and climb aboard a huge Cold War submarine. Inside are looks at torpedo tubes, crew dining areas, officers' quarters, the control room, and much more. Any visit here to the Carnegie Science Center will almost certainly teach you something you didn't know before walking through the doors. After all, where else can you explore fish, investigate a submarine, and immerse yourself into a fascinating world of robots? Now, I'm a machine, I'm controlled by a computer, and I'm doing something that a human might do all day, talking to you, delightful people. Does that make me a real robot? Go on in and check out the exhibit, then you decide.